In this video, we will create personalized name server like ns1.yourdomain.com in Namecheap. Log into your Namecheap.com account, then go to the dashboard, click on the domain list. Uh, you will see all your domain name. Uh, we need ns1. This is the domain name under which we need the name survey is created. So click on the manage. Click on the advanced DNS. Scroll down. Uh, here you will see register name server. Click on add name service. We need to add NS1. Then we need to put the IP address of the server. We have this server here. I will take the IP address of this cPanel server. This is going to be the DNS server for this domain. So put this domain name here and click done. Now we need to create another name server NS2. Uh, repeat the same step, uh, put the IP address here and click done. So we have two name servers NS1 and NS2 created. In cPanel, you can click on the basic in WHM, you can click on the basic WHM manager setup. Scroll down, you need to put the NS1 and NS2 IP here. After that, you can configure the IP address record. Use the same IP address. Put the IP address here. This is a, this server have only one IP. So both NS1 and NS2 will use this exactly same IP. Then configure address records. Click on this button. Close. And do the same for NS2. Click on configure address records. Enter the IP for address here. Then click on configure address records. Okay, that's it done. Uh, now you can change the name server for this domain to the newly created ns1 dot uh, domain name and ns2. For that, click on the domain name, uh, domain, click on this domain button. Then here by default, it is using the basic DNS name chip, basic DNS. Instead, change to custom DNS. Now you can put your, the domain name is this. So put ns1 dot domain name, ns2 dot domain. You don't need this slash. That is part of copying. Okay, so ns1 dot domain, ns2 dot domain. And uh, to save this, you have to click this uh, small green tick box. The DNS will take uh, like a few hours to propagate. Uh, there will be DNS server update. Okay, they, they said it will take 48 hours. Normally, it won't take that much time. To verify the name server changed, you can go take a terminal. And then, then run the command who is the domain name. That will show if the name server is changed. Okay, the name server is changed now. And that's one. So it will take only some like one or two hours to propagate the DNS depending on the name service. So let us see if the website is working. Uh, for that we have to go to this URL. Now it is still showing the name chip parked page. That is uh, because the DNS propagation is not yet completed. If I ping this server, it will show name chip IP address instead of the server IP address. That is ending with 58. 
if you do an NS lookup for this domain with this name server, uh, it is not resolving yet because it will take uh, some time for the DNS propagation. Anyway, we can verify if DNS is working properly with the server IP. Asking the server IP, this is a server IP. Okay, let's look up domain name server IP. It is resolving properly, so it will take some time for the DNS to propagate. That is how you create personalized name server in Namecheap. Hope you enjoyed this video. See you in another.